Pathfinder, got a minute? You have new email at your terminal, Pathfinder. The swelling has gone down significantly, and I seem to be able to talk normally again. Good. Keep me updated, and remember, cool food and liquid only. Nothing spicy. Thank you, Lexi. Is there something wrong? Did you hurt yourself? Oh, it's nothing. I'm just getting over some inflammation of the soft tissues of the mouth. It was dramatic, but ultimately non-threatening. I... What? Have you ever heard of the Lick Test? Back before scanners were portable, Earth scientists would employ this test in the field. They used it to tell rocks from fossils and get a basic idea of their mineral composition. <laughs> you licked a rock, didn't you? I was distracted and forgot it was a Helios rock. I do it unconsciously. When I was little, my father and I would go on expeditions. The lick test was a huge part of it. He made science fun for me. Your mother was something of a scientist, wasn't she? She specialized in biotics research. Got her start in medicine. I read all about her research and your father's. AI and implants. They achieved so much in so little time. Sam is an astounding achievement. I left my parents back home. They told me they were proud of me. And then lived out their lives while I slept. If I were them, I'd be proud too. You came here for the sake of science. That takes courage. Some crazy, but mostly courage. I'm sure they knew that. <laughs> Thank you, Ryder. I needed that. Anytime. Digest it without heavy processing. Cellulolysis would be hugely inefficient. Are you still trying to figure out how to eat Helios flora? Oh, shoot. I was talking out loud again, wasn't I? Find something? Something pinged us. An ID request. The Tempest auto responded. We'll keep an eye out in the sector. The scent is green. Coordinating. Path is calm.
back where we really started. What's new in our first home? The cats still maintain a presence. Skirmishes are frequent, and travel requires caution. I've got a cure for that. Next. The atmosphere continues to clear, but radioactive hazards pool in some areas. Study is ongoing. And remnant remain active on the surface, but also as detected by seismic readings. Point of contact for all this? Your people, Pathfinder. Prodromos is expanding with all the trials and discovery that building an outpost represents. Grounded in research. All data about newly accessible EOS is from their work. Well, let's make sure it gets the attention it deserves. Armed and armored. Good for you. I could have used that ordinance a few weeks ago. I'm Ryder, the human pathfinder. Lieutenant Harper. We're looking for the Asari Ark. So am I. Watching the skies every day, praying they survived the cat. The evidence pointed to the cat being involved. The way pain is involved when you get burned. What happened? The cat chased our Ark across the cluster. But these weren't their regular soldiers. They were hunters. Elite killers. None of the Arcs are armed. I don't like those odds. They kept shooting to slow us down. Peeled one deck like an orange. A bridge officer, Sarissa something, gave the evacuation order. Hundreds of people, all trying to flee. It, it was... Where could we look for the Ark? We lost track. But they launched a ship to help evacuees. And her crew would know. You'd have to find her. Follow the transponder, maybe. Consider it done. Focus on taking care of yourselves. The ship's called the Parafona. I'll give you her transponder codes and last flight plan. Thank you. It's... good to see the Ket aren't the only ones winning. Sentence go. Leaving Atmel. All clear. I think Lexi wanted to speak to you.
Ah, Ryder. Sorry for the mess. Who's your friend? An exalted cat. I called Jarl to show him. Ah, oh, there he is. Jarl, look at this. There's nothing Angara inside. The physical can be deceiving. I've run hundreds of tests. Only traces of the Angara genome remain. The exalted are Ket. There must be a way to fix them. Anything's possible. We just have to keep trying. Even from mistakes, we can learn. Thank you, Ryder. What? Jarl needs to accept that exaltation is permanent. You're making his grief worse. We've barely scratched the surface of what Cat are capable of. The Exalted are new beings. It's more than a transformation, it's a birth. There's no going back. Jarl is part of this crew. His welfare is my responsibility. I know this job was a surprise, but you've really stepped up. And look, you got your Cat sample. Their bodies are unlike anything I've seen. Centuries of gene stealing, crafted evolution. It's horrible, of course, but also fascinating. Glad you're settling in. Sink or swim, right? <sighs> I should probably clean this up before it starts to smell. Need something? I'll let you get back to it. I'll be here if you need me. Suvi, that woman on the Nexus, she's a widow of one of my pilots. The people you were training to explore the Scourge? Zoe's wife was lost out there. For a fellow pilot, one does the right thing. Like making sure her widow has got enough credits. It's the least I can do. The most is conquering the Scourge once and for all. Anomaly on sensors. Deploying probe. That a satellite? Is that what pinged us in this sector? It's pulsing an initiative call response code. Someone knows our tech inside and out. Let's get a scan. Trackback measure? Drive system overloaded. Not quick enough, though. I got a serial that has triggered an alert. Pathfinder, we are to contact Director Addison as soon as possible. What is going on? Pathfinder, you have pending vid calls.
Ryder, tell me about the satellite you found. Director? What are you talking about? My alert identified a ZK resource tracker. They're emergency tech, full of overrides so they can bypass protocol. They were designed by Dr. Zoe Jean Kennedy. She disappeared with the Exiles. If her tech has shown up, that could give someone a backdoor to steal from your outposts. Why were these trackers allowed to bypass protocols? They're supposed to be hubs. To rapidly track and pull resources if lives are at stake somewhere. That's why they weren't deployed. Tan didn't like anyone bypassing his rubber stamp. If this satellite is new, how has it kept up with our security measures? That's a very good question. What was Dr. Kennedy's role in the initiative? She designed the orbital beacons, forward stations, and half the kit in the Tempest. She'd ram an upgrade through before the requisition was on Tan's desk. Dr. Kennedy disappeared along with the Exiles. That was a big loss. Pretty extreme to set up a personal alert. Why do that? A lot of Dr. Kennedy's projects were unofficial. But you backed them, like these trackers. I don't want some asshole using my access codes to cut a backdoor into our resources, or Tan blaming me for it. But I also want to know what happened to her. She disappeared with the Exiles, but you aren't calling her one? She sympathized, but we'd never let an expert like that go. She was vital. But in the chaos, a lot of things, and people, went missing. If we have to find the tech or the person, where do we begin? You got a sliver of data from the first tracker. With more scans, maybe Suvi can assemble a point of origin. Obviously, these trackers are being deployed where initiative tech is concentrated. That means outposts. Try another outpost system, or place more. Maybe you'll draw them out, whoever they are. And when we find them? They're stealing our resources. My concern is Dr. Kennedy, her tech, their lives. In that order. Fold. Beginning approach. Orbit is steady. Approaching the LZ. I'm reading a severe temperature drop.
Ambient temperature is normal. Temperatures are below freezing and continuing to fall. I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. Life support at 100%. showed up you seem thrilled honestly it's nothing special nothing special you saved the Moshai from the Ket and not just the Moshai so many people owe you their lives anyway I should get to the point your raid on the exaltation facility sent the Ket scrambling they're trying to get their operations in order our scouts report increased Ket movement through certain areas of Vold not military, though. Science and research vessels. So something that could involve exaltation, or the creation of a new exaltation lab. Well, that's what I thought. Either way, Ket organizing means trouble. We don't have the tech to break into their bases, but someone has to stop them. You're talking to the right person. We always help our friends and allies. I knew you'd help. I'll send the nav point immediately. I'm reading a severe temperature drop. How's your sister? Environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. Nightmare Life still? support is back online. I'm sorry. All we can do is be there when she needs us. Okay, Sam, what's Vold got for us? Ket activity appears to be centered around this large central command post. According to Resistance Intelligence, the base coordinates all Ket military efforts on Vold. And taking it down will cripple their operations. In theory. However, given the trouble the Angara Resistance has had infiltrating the base, it will not be a simple task. I recommend a more cautious approach that starts with the investigation of smaller Ket installations. What about the Angara? The Resistance? What's their status? Resistance dispatches indicate there is someone in Hojara who needs help. We could visit Tekix, a larger and more established Angara Dar that is nearby. Sounds good. Thanks, Sam. Pathfinder, Vold's temperature range is fixed well below freezing, with pockets of even more severe conditions. This necessitates the use of the Nomad. I advise against prolonged exposure to the cold. Got it. Don't crash the car. Our scans have detected remnant monoliths which suggests the presence of a vault. And that means we might be able to melt this ice cube. All right, we've got our work cut out for us. Let's get going. Please be careful, Ryder. Trust me. <clears throat> Follow the lights, Ryder. Out of the world. 
worst of it. Temperature should be manageable now. that those cat are dead. Ugh. I thought I could lead them the other way. If you hadn't come along, they'd be halfway to our camp by now. How bad are you hurt? Can you make it back? It'll be comical, but I can walk, and I know a secret route to the camp. Just wide enough for one. I can get back faster than you're over. What are you doing out here? I'm just a scout. I'm supposed to make sure the cat get lost out here and stay lost. But they were more prepared than I thought. I got... I got careless. Have the cat tracked down the resistance here? No, no. These scum caught a signal flash and were too stubborn to ignore it. You didn't give them time to report in. All their superiors will know is that they went missing in the blizzard. We have to keep going. Go, go. I'll roll the cat bodies off the cliff before I head back. Temperature is falling, Pathfinder. Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. His cat have been here, Pathfinder.
Look, the cat set up camp. Let's do this! Time for a field op, Jal. What's your combat disposition? I kill the enemy before they see me. Do I need another one? No, that'll do fine. Remnant sight ahead, Pathfinder. Picking up a faint signal. Looks like a friendly ship. It matches the transponder code for Asari survey vessel, Peri Fona. That's the ship Hadaria mentioned. We might be close.
Pathfinder. I detect Ket among the salvage. I detect an Angaran data device, transmitting a low-frequency homing signal. Someone left it on purpose. Ice or mineral deposits may be reflecting false positives. The real signal must be relatively close. Thank you. 